I am Steven Sylvester. I'm a former collegiate and professional athlete and now entrepreneur. Family's a big part of my life. I grew up with my six cousins and older brother, and so there were eight of us. Sports was a big part of how my mom was able to keep track of all of us. Somebody had some kind of basketball game or practice to be at, so it was very easy to make sure we stayed out of trouble. Going in high school, I was a multi-sport athlete, and I ended up you know, getting a full-ride football scholarship to the University of Utah and came here to the University of Utah and uh, just had fun. Graduated college and was fortunate enough to, to be drafted into the National Football League. Then I had a five-year career. It was an amazing experience that I'll forever remember. So my senior year in college, I get a bone bruise on my patella. It ended up over time calcifying and creating a nice little lump. So my whole career, I ended up just not even noticing it most of the time. And then uh, my fifth year, my last year with Buffalo, my DB nicks my knee. So I ended up having surgery. With the calcification being gone from my knee, uh, I was even better than I was before the injury. So I was training so hard to get back. I was in shape. I just needed an opportunity to go play again and I never got another workout. So that was kind of the end of my career. You know, a lot of people that play football in the National Football League, everybody tells you NFL means not for long. So I always had that in the back of my head. So I'm just like, okay, if plan A, which is going back into the NFL, doesn't work, what happens? So I started looking into what is my next career gonna be? Talking to a lot of people who have gone into the space and transitioned out of sports, they're like, do stuff you love. So I had to figure out, what do I love? And in and, and doing that, I love to help people. I love being around people. I love networking. So I decided, let me start a nonprofit organization around what I know. I know sports. I know athletes love giving back. So I started Athletes Strong. We take athletes and do community service projects throughout the Salt Lake Valley. Doing the nonprofit work, it's awesome. It's great. I love it but it's nonprofit. So I had to figure out a way, like how am I gonna eventually make money? So I started looking into entrepreneurship. And again, I took the aspect of finding out things that you love to do. I also love to get my hair cut. If I could, I'd get my hair cut once a week. I was actually headed to one of my community service events and I needed a haircut. And so I was talking to uh, another athlete and I'm just like, do you have trouble getting your hair cut? And we went into this deep conversation as to how hard it is to communicate with your barber. Light bulb. I started to do research on the industry, and I'm just like, okay, there's something here. Communication is lost. So I decided to create an app to handle the interpersonal communication between client and provider. The app we made is called Clip. With the many different projects that I'm a part of, my entrepreneurial endeavors that I'm a part of, I understand that there's one key factor, support. I need help just like everybody needs help. Being a member of America First, I have just experienced the most amazing people that have helped me do everything that I need to do. In order for us to get better and us to advance in life, I think we just need to support one another, providing services like community service, um, these little things to know that we all care about each other. We're all human beings at the end of the day. So let's coexist.